I want to share something with you. My name is Karen Chapson from John Leap's Evangelization. Jesus sits at the right hand of the Father. We take it for granted. But one time, I was contemplating on that and I kept thinking about, what does that mean, the right hand of the Father? Many people say it's the position of power, it's a position of honor, but that wasn't what I felt the Holy Spirit was driving me to dig in deeper. So I kept praying about it and praying about it and praying about it, looking at scripture. And what came to me was, that's what it is. Jesus serves his Father, his right hand of the Father, because he serves him. He's at his beck and call. John 5:30. I can of my own self do nothing. As I hear, I judge, and my judgment is just, because I seek not mine own will, but the will of the Father, which hath sent me. I was reading Psalms one day, Psalms 6, 8, I have set the Lord always before me, because he is at my right hand, I shall not be moved. So God is saying that he will help us, he's at our right hand too, he's at the Father's right hand and he's at our right hand, he's here to serve. How amazing is God, that actually started to make me cry because I was thinking, he's our God, he's almighty, he created the world, he's omnipotent omnipresent yet he serves us and it's true okay in Luke 22 27 he says I am among you as one who serves and then he says in Matthew 20 28 just as the Son of Man did not come to be served but to serve and to give his life as a ransom for many he's stressing the point that he serves he came to serve and he further says in Matthew 16 24 then Jesus said to his disciples, whoever wants to be my disciple must deny themselves and take up their cross and follow me. So we must serve. We must serve. Do you notice that when you serve, you're the happiest that you can be? When you do nothing and are lazy or just serve yourself, you're not happy. You become more moody. You become more discontent. Our lives are meant to serve. Our lives are worth something when we serve. We serve God when we serve our brothers and sisters. Blessed Mother was a handmaid. She was a handmaid of the Lord. She came to serve. She still serves us. Look, I'm wearing the miraculous medal. Oh Mary conceived without sin. Pray for us who have recourse to thee. She serves us by being the intercessor, a strong intercessor to God. She will never stop serving us until all of us are together with her that choose to be. Remember, let us serve our Lord God till our last dying breath. Let us always seek his will. That's where we'll get our worth, our identity, and our joy. God bless you.